I think Scott came to my house and said, I have something exciting to tell you, but I'm not telling you until tomorrow. And I was really a little annoyed by that because I couldn't sleep that night. The wait was worth it. Tony Pappas was in for a shock when her longtime friends and contractors showed her what they found while restoring her barn. They were down a foot below the uh, these cracks right here on the other side. A Ted Williams rookie card and 51 other baseball cards from the late 1930s to early 40s. Also, I look in there about a foot down. There's 51 more cards and I stopped pulling them out pulling them out, pulling them out. So we have 52 cars total and we're going through them. And we just recognize Ted Williams right off the bat. Landry thinks those cards could be worth tens of thousands of dollars. They're having them appraised right now, but Tony says she doesn't plan on selling them anytime soon. Right away, I thought, oh my gosh, those were Billy's cards. The Pappas's house on Hanover Street is where Tony and her late husband, Billy, built a life together. It's also where Billy spent most of his childhood. I can reminisce and imagine my husband, maybe at 10 or 12 years old, he was looking at all these cards and playing with them, trading them off with other kids, and probably dreaming that he'd be a great athlete someday. Tony says Billy was a natural athlete, a baseball Hall of Famer himself at the University of New Hampshire, a player for his Air Force football team and the love of her life. And I think he's smiling down at us. I really think he's laughing and happy that we found them. Tony says if she does sell the cards, she'll likely donate the proceeds to the sports scholarship she has in her husband's name at UNH. Isabel Litteris, WMUR News 9.